Stella Maris is a facility that helps people get sober and rebuild their lives. Stella Maris to me is, is the most godsend place I've ever met. Um, it's where I came and got sober. It's one of the oldest alcohol and drug detox facilities in the United States. Stella Maris is hope for the hopeless, is the potential for to re remake lives, to, to change people's futures. They are amazing, like amazing, phenomenal. I just want people to to give themselves a chance to change. Here at Southern Maris, they will have a team of people who care and who actually understand exactly what they're going through, how to get through it, and what to do when we get to the other side. Our main goal is to um, meet all their needs from the detox withdrawal stage all the way through to the supportive housing and aftercare. Most of the clients that come through, uh, when they get here, they feel broken. And when they see a man that's helping to helping them and he says that, well, I've been sober for two months, I've been sober for three months, well, this is what happens to me next if I follow what this guy is doing. To see somebody uh, succeed, somebody who gets the other side, it is very fulfilling and satisfying and it is encouraging and it makes me know that I'm not wasting my time here. We are absolutely uh, saving lives. Certainly one of the most important things that we do for people when they're really in crisis is to provide detox services. And you'll see them go through their detoxification process and then you'll see them either go to the dorm or uh, either IOP or even our PHP program and there's this light that just kind of shines through them and you know getting sober is really hard and difficult and um, it can be scary at times but being able to be kind of like a calm sense or even a smile or happy or some sort of happy energy for them is really a goal of mine. I think Stella Morris is also known for helping people that don't have private insurance, that don't have the ability to pay, you know, twelve, fifteen thousand dollars um, to come in for uh, detox and drug treatment. Prior to my position, they only had facilities for men. And so they recognized the need for women and were able to open housing. We have two portions of the house. We have a downstairs portion, which where girls come right out of detox or a recent relapse. And they come and they do partial hospitalization programming and then they do transition to IOP. I get the guys that have been doing really strong program building here. And so they're transitioned into to sober living house for the next phase of development by the time they get to me. I get to just help them continue on that path. We want to breathe life into them. And, I, and I'm getting like chills just thinking about that because like that's what we do here. But my main focus here is to uh, engage these clients in our Thinking for Change program, which is intensive outpatient therapy. Outpatient treatment, supportive housing, and eventually sober housing, all so that they can get back to their communities and their families and find work and rewarding lives. There's a common bond when they realize, yeah, there's something going on with me, and it's the same thing that's going on with him. And they get a chance to work together and make changes together. There's a lot of guys that come from just the streets, you know, couch surfing, wherever they might be. Nobody has insurance or money, you know, and that's this is the, the, that godsend place that you can come to detox and then transition into the inpatient treatment plan. We got it all right here. Coffee shop, somewhere to hang out, then all the IOP, aftercare, job programs. They give you a bus pass, you know, you sign into the doctor where you go and make your appointments with your caseworker to help you get all that sorted out. That's the best part, it'll take anybody. Our clients have to get the fact that we care, and I hear that a lot. They have actually said, uh, I've been to a lot of other treatment centers, but people didn't really care. Uh, or I could tell that the person didn't care about what I was saying, but, but they can tell that we do. These people, they care about you. They care. People at Stella Maris care. And I do have a passion for this. I want to help somebody. I want to help change, um, even if it's just one life. <laughs>